Hey guys, my name is Arsalan. Welcome back to my channel. And today we are going to solve a new lead code question that is number of rectangles that can form the largest square. So guys, just before starting to solve this question, please do subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, press the bell icon button and bookmark the playlist so that you can get the updates from the channel. So just before starting to quote this question, let's read out the question and understand what they're asking from the <coughs> so <coughs> you are given an array of rectangles where rectangles i is equals to l i w i represent the i rectangle of length l i and width w i you can cut the i rectangle to form a square with the side length of k if both k is less than uh, less than equal to l i and k is less than equal to width and uh, for example if you have a rectangle 4 6 you can cut it with a get a square of 4 at max 4 yeah we can understand this thing here let max length be the length or, or side of the largest square you can obtain from any rectangles okay so return the number of rectangles that can form uh, that can make a square with a side length of max length so what we are gonna do here is let's understand this discussion with the help of some examples we'll mention below i know that some most of you under this question by reading it however let's understand it in a better way so that we can when while we coding this question we do not face any difficulty in uh, relating the question so <clears throat> let's see what example number one says see we have a rectangle array and it's an nested array uh, it's an nested list in python we can say okay so what we have we what we are gonna do here is uh, to make a uh, to create a score we know that it should have so both length same so uh, five is the most uh, five is the highest size the largest size size of largest size of length uh, we can create uh, a square of if we talk about the first uh, first square this is the first square this is second square so three is the uh, largest length because we cannot create it with nine because nine is uh, beyond the length of three okay so here is again five here is again five what we are gonna do here is we have to just create a we have just have to take out the numbers and then we have to check uh, that we can create the square so we can create a square of 5 8 by 5 5 5 there it will be 3 3 here it will be 5 5 and here also it will be 5 5 now we are we will be getting an array of 5 3 5 5 5 and between these through these four elements these four integers we have to check out the maximum number so the maximum value here is 5 so we have to check that how many squares of maximum uh, integer we can create the square with so there are three numbers of uh, <coughs> maximum values which is five so we can create three squares of five similarly in this question you can see that the elements coming out here would be two three four three three so three 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 there are there are three threes here you can see that three threes here so these are the maximum values in the minimum values of the square so that's all we have to do this so uh, while we code i will explain it to you in, in a more better way so let's start coding this first of all i am gonna i'm gonna create a min array or a min list you can say min list okay and i will be creating an empty array in which i will be appending the values in these so what uh, values i'm gonna append here is i am just i will be just appending the minimum values of these each individual ith value so <clears throat> let's see what i'm seeing here is for num in uh, range or else i would i could say for i in range len rectangle rectangles and in that i will be checking uh, min list dot append all the values which are min so min rectangles uh, rectangles i all right guys I, after i do this what i will be getting in my min list is min list would be equal to this five uh three five and five 
so after i do this thing this uh, whole code here what i will be getting here in this main list is 5355 because what i have done here is i have checked that in uh, <coughs> for each individual ith value this will be my each individual ith 58 <coughs> is one second is my this array 39 third is my uh, this array fourth is my this array so i am checking that in each individual element just give me the minimum value between those two values so between 5 8 i will be getting 5 between 3 9 i will be getting 3 between 5 4 5 12 i will be getting 5 between 16 and 5 i will be getting 5 again uh, so i have just append these values and min is a mathematic function in python which allows me to get the minimum value okay so <coughs> i now i have these uh, four values here so now i will be just quick doing what i will be just doing here is i will be saying that min list min list dot dot sort okay i should make it a uh, capital s however it will not create any effect on my code uh, but still so min list dot sort after i sort this what i will be gonna getting here is i will be just getting let me explain it to you i will be getting three five five and five three five 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 so after i sort this i will be getting this why i have sorted this because i will be taking this last element so last element will always be largest value okay that's why i have done this so after I sort this, it will be uh, it will be sorted in an ascending order, and now I can take take this last element so that I will be getting a maximum number. So max square s q u a r e is equals to uh, min list minus one. So after I do this minus one, I will be getting this here. Okay right i hope i you have understood that what max square will be getting max square will get, get me this element let me write it here i will be getting max square is equals to sq u a r e is equals to um five so max square is equals to five okay now i will be creating a count variable which will be counting my this number in my this list okay so i will be checking for num in min list uh if if num is equals to max square then count the value increase the count <coughs> value of count by one and return me the count all right now what I have done here is count will be initialized. I have created a uh, variable which will be initialized by zero. And now I have say, taken a loop here in which I have said that for num in min list, mon, nums will be these values 3555. Five, five. So for each individual value, it will be checking. I have created a conditional here that uh, each, in, each individual check will be checking that whether it's matching with my main, uh, max square or not if it's matching with max square then it's increase the count by one so num will be first of all three so it will check with max square whether it's equal to it or not so it's it will be not equal then it will just <coughs> uh, then again it will uh, it will just go out the loop and then it will again come to the loop and iterate it until the it exits the loop so <coughs> it will check three times that uh, there two the condition will be met three times so our, our count will be increased by three so let's run this code and check for an answer so see it has been running successfully this is all we have to do in this question i hope you have understood this question guys and i hope you have liked the uh, tutorial and explanation of the video thank you guys for watching this video and see you next time